Hey friends, welcome back to another video. My name is Emma Fave, and today I am doing a 2022 sketchbook tour. I don't know why this always kind of freaks me out. It feels very intimate to let you into every page in my sketchbook because I'll let you know now. Sometimes I just go like this. <laughs> I just paint nothing or something really badly or just scribble because I'm frustrated or just, I, I don't even know. I just kind of don't really think about it too much and I'm gonna show you what's inside three of my sketchbooks from this year. You're gonna see some past tutorials, you'll have a sneak peek of some of the things I've done on Patreon, and then just some of the pages that make no sense at all. So let's jump in and take a look. Okay, like I said, I don't know why I'm nervous, but it's just, <laughs> I do get nervous. Not like you guys are gonna judge me or my sketchbooks, but um, yeah, sometimes I just don't have any explanation for some of these paintings. So let's get into it. I should be better at labeling the years and um, the dates in these sketchbooks, but I haven't. So I don't know which one comes first. I think it might be this one, but yeah. So here, just I guess I'm, I'm painting some white florals. Don't know why, wasn't for anything special, just playing around. Um, this I think was, I don't, it might've been a time-lapse, not a tutorial, but then I wanted to go bright red, vibrant red, really loose. And I started using a filbert brush for this, but I really enjoyed doing those centers. That was fun. Um, again, just more flower practice. I don't know, more random flowers. I think this was also a time-lapse of something. Don't know what, here I need to move this. Um, Again, just more practice with my filbert brush. You know, it was kind of foreign to me of this kind of uh, just painting with a different shape brush. So I was just practicing a lot with that. Um, this is just me playing around with those Supervision watercolors, the like muted vintage palette, which was a lot of fun. Like they look so vintagey, the colors. That was really nice. And literally just playing around. I don't. I don't have any explanation besides that. <laughs> Seeing just rainbows, just playing with the palette, the colors. Seeing how they bleed. I like those purple flowers. Maybe I'll take that out again. This, I don't know. I don't know what that was for. Was that for playing? I think, I don't know. <laughs> I think it was playing with different shapes of brushes, I think. And again, the same kind of flowers. Again, this is like what my sketchbooks are full of. Um, a big shout out to, uh, obviously, my Etcher family over there because they they are so great with their sketchbooks. I love these things. Um, but I feel like I, you know, there's so many pages in these things that, and the paper quality is so great that I, I feel like I can just play around in these sketchbooks. So there's those ones. I think that might've been the tutorial. Again, just playing rainbow a lot of this going on i don't know don't think that was a tutorial either just playing around didn't love it was that a tutorial that might have been a tutorial i can't remember this is just a lot of playing and it's funny because i look at these and i don't love them but i'm showing them to you <laughs> Um, this was a tutorial. This was like a playing with watercolor versus gouache, doing the same landscape, which was interesting. Um, that was fun. I enjoyed that. And then this, I think, was inspired by Sarah Cray. She did something similar on her Instagram, and I was like, I want to try that. Um, peaches. Love painting peaches. They're just so pretty and vibrant. There's that. Whoop. This was a tutorial this wreath, this orange wreath. And then this was one of my Patreon exclusive tutorials, which was a lot of fun to do. Um, oh, actually I should get back into doing that. Not the Patreon tutorials, I'm already doing that, but the storefront illustrations, I forgot about that. <laughs> um, this was a Patreon exclusive tutorial as well. That I don't know what that was. Um, I can't remember if this was Patreon or not. I think it might have just been YouTube. Check it out. Um, my Birds of Paradise. I tried it a couple times because I didn't know if I liked it or not. See? I think this is the one I did. I like the blending on this stem better. It was a bit more vibrant. That was a tutorial. This looks like really crappy paint. 
I can't remember what this was. I feel like that was like using really cheap paint for something. Don't quote me, but I feel like it was because I can see it. It's like a little chalky looking. This was a tutorial for what? I don't know. This was me trying out art of soil paints, I guess. <laughs> um, this must have been some sort of tutorial, I think. Might have been one of my workshop um, practice things. I don't know. I think for the loose florals. I think that's what it was. My workshop. I don't actually remember a lot of this stuff. Yeah, I think that was my July workshop. These were some of the um, practice kind of, what are they called? Drills that we did beforehand. That's what, yeah, that's, this is the workshop. That's why it's done a couple times because I do two workshops a month. So that's what that is. Color palettes, trying out different bright, vibrant color palettes, seeing what goes together. Um, really wanted to try and experiment a bit more with color this year. Really inspired by other people's bright colors. So I wanted to try that. I think this was a tutorial. I don't know. Then I tried to paint some really loose cats, which I hated, so I never did anything with it. <laughs> and that's all for this one. That was fun, guys. Okay, let's see what else I got. Ugh. So, so nerve wracking. Okay. I want to like peek before I show you guys. Like random. What is this? I don't know. What is this? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes I just try things and like a little bit of like color will inspire me. Like this dark neutral tone with bright. I don't know. I say I don't know a lot. This. Was that a five minute landscape? That might have been like a tester before I did the actual video see what I kind of want. Yeah, I think it was to see what I could do in five minutes before I did the video. These colorful poppies. Boop. Using red. I think I was trying out some sort of brush. My desk illustration. This is a tutorial. That was fun. Um, and then when I don't like things, I paint black gouache over top because then <laughs> I could paint with gouache over top of this. I don't know what's under there, but yeah. I think, oh, this was my five minute florals, which did not turn out the greatest. This looks like a dog, see? The eyes and the nose, the snout. There's that. Um, these are my testers for the subscription box watercolors. So I had to go through every single color that they sent me, break it down into 48 colors that I was gonna use throughout the box um, decide which months they were going to go with. This was a lot of testing and I ended up doing it in here just because I had larger pages. But yeah, that's for the subscription box. See? More testing, different shades, which ones I liked better. Um, a lot went into that. The tree tutorial that I did on YouTube. I did this. Um, is this a hibiscus? Or am I just imagining? Is that what the flower's called? I can't, my brain stopped working. Working. Um, this was me testing out my January tutorial for the subscription boxes, just kind of deciding what I wanted to do. Did I want to do mountains or do, like a wintry um, tree thing? And I ended up going with this design and then creating it for the box to make it look a little bit better. But that was just some tester stuff. Those were the mini landscapes from that tutorial. This was my workshop from August. We did water from my book actually. So these were some of the drills and practice, thing, practice things that we did throughout. And then this was, I don't know, painting eucalyptus. This was a tutorial, I think on, did I do that for Patreon or YouTube? I can't remember. And that was a tutorial. It's really into poppies this year. This was some sort of tutorial, I think. <laughs> I can't remember anything. I don't know what's ups why it's upside down. This was a tutorial on shading and shadows. If you haven't seen it, go watch it. This was, I don't know. No idea. This is a Patreon exclusive. That was really fun to do. I like painting mushrooms and like working with the shadows. That was a lot of fun to do. I don't know, playing around with ideas for fall, I guess. Little doodles for fall. I didn't do anything with I tried to do like line work I don't know <laughs> it's not great I don't love it 
fall floral stuff. I think that's a real. This is, I don't know. <laughs> More flowers. Oh, this is a, my, I think, September workshop. So we practiced doing our loose versus, what was it, detailed flowers. Oh, my son did this. I was like, wow, that's great, Emma. He made a spider and a pumpkin. That was so cute. Um, more doodles. These are my fall nature things. Pumpkins that I did for a reel. Love this one. This one was a fun tutorial. I love painting trees. My fall trees. I think I was trying to do like some ideas for like a cozy fall thing. I think that was my son. I have no idea. Garbage. I don't know. <laughs> this. Was that a tutorial? I think that might have been a tutorial. Don't know. Whoops. Sorry. There's so much stuff on my desk. And then this was the white painting white objects reel, I think. Or this was the ghost. Look at the happy ghosts. They're so cute. Okay. And that's that one. And now we got one more to go. One more to go. And then that is it maybe. Um, okay. So let's see, we got a first page that is blank. Cause I, I don't have a weird thing about painting on the first page, but yeah, uh, this was a Patreon exclusive leaves, which was a tutorial. This was something I don't know, or I think that was a reel about blooms or my tutorial on hard edges on how to do that. That was, I think, for a tutorial. That, I don't know. That was a real. This was a tutorial, I think, which I get, I think I'll revisit that. It was like five easy florals that we'll do. I think I'll do five more at some point. This was for my October workshop. I guess I do a lot of workshop stuff in here. Um, trials. This was about Oh, there's cute bears that I saw someone paint, so I wanted to try it too. Um, this was about perspective. Again, workshop. Painting leaves. That was a reel. That was a reel. <laughs> Just painting. That was a tutorial. Halloween, my favorite. I decided to try and illustrate a little witch. Didn't love it, so I didn't do anything with it. That was perspective. That was a moody landscape for the fall. I don't know. I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh, this is, I think, using the different brushes, I think. I think. Um, I don't even know what color swatches these are, to be honest. Mm, oh, I think this was testing out the difference between my Craftimo paints and my Winsor Newton. That's what that is. Our winter... Christmas wreath. That was a tutorial. This was, I think, a Patreon exclusive. This was me trying to do that glowing tree. This was just testing it out. Wasn't working. Um, and I was just playing with some more stuff for a tutorial here. This was just like a super quick mock-up of one of the tutorials that are gonna be in my watercolor subscription boxes. Actually, I'll show you the finished painting because I'm actually pretty proud of that. Um, this is gonna be May's tutorial for the watercolor subscription box. Shh, don't tell anybody. I actually really love this one. I was very proud of this. So that was just me kind of playing around with ideas. Then this was my November workshop. We did the poinsettia, which was fun. I don't know what that is. A tree. Oh, this is a real. This was Patreon exclusive live. We did some little animals. This was my five minute landscapes. This was my recent tutorial. Love that. That was fun. I love painting trees. I think I already said that. This, I don't know. I don't know what that is. <laughs> no idea. Sometimes I just paint just to paint. This was a tutorial on value for my Monday morning watercolor tips. I was just playing around with like tree ideas. 
these are awful penguins. I was just in a mood this day. Nothing was working out. And then I just scribbled because I was mad. Um, my winter essentials video. Ta -da. This was for my most recent um, painting from a landscape reference photo. I was going to try and do winter photos, photos, flowers, florals, whatever. Hated it. Didn't like it. Um, I saw Sarah Cray do this thing with dots and just I just needed to just put paint on paper for fun so I did that um and then this was a patreon exclusive I think live that was fun the gingerbread house and then this was from my most recent workshop for December um that was just like the not the drills but the practice for the finished painting which was this so yeah that is the end of my third sketchbook. And then I do have some of like loose things and that's about it. So there's my little sketchbook tour. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I really hope you liked it and I hope you learned something or just got to see a little glimpse into what is in my creative head sometimes. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram and all my other platforms for tons more content. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!